John Mortimer Brinkley, born 1763 or 1766, died the 14th of September 1835, was the first royal astronomer of Ireland and later Bishop of Cloyne. He was president of the Royal Irish Academy 1822 to 35, president of the Royal Astronomical Society 1831 to 33. He was awarded the Cunningham Medal in 1818 and the Copley Medal in 1824. Early years Brinkley was born in Woodbridge, Suffolk and was baptised there on 31 January 1763, the illegitimate son of Sarah Brinkley, a butcher's daughter. On being admitted to Cambridge, he was recorded as being the son of John Toller Brinkley, a vintner, but it is strongly suggested that his real father was John Toller, 1st Earl of Norbury, Chief Justice of the Irish Court of Common Pleas. His exact date of birth is unknown. He has often been assigned the birth year 1763, as at least one obituary gives his age at death in 1835 as 72. However, his memorial at Trinity College, Dublin states that he died aged 70. Also, he was recorded as being 17 upon matriculation at Gonville and Keyes College, Cambridge in August 1783, both of which imply a slightly later birth year. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Career. He graduated Bachelor of Arts in 1788 as Senior Wrangler and Smith's Prizeman, was elected a Fellow of the College and was awarded Cambridge Master of Arts in 1791. He was ordained at Lincoln Cathedral in the same year. In 1792 he became the second Andrews Professor of Astronomy in the University of Dublin, which carried the new title of Royal Astronomer of Ireland. Together with John Law, Bishop of Elphin, he drafted the chapter on Astronomy, in William Paley's Natural Theology. His main work concerns stellar astronomy and he published his Elements of Plane Astronomy in 1808. In 1818 he was awarded the prestigious Cunningham Medal of the Royal Irish Academy and in 1822 was elected a Foreign Honorary Member of the American Academy of Arts and Sciences. He was awarded the Copley Medal by the Royal Society in 1824. Brinkley's observations that several stars shifted their apparent place in the sky in the course of a year were disproved at Greenwich by his contemporary John Pond, the Astronomer Royal. In 1826, he was appointed Bishop of Cloyne in County Cork, a position he held for the remaining nine years of his life. Brinkley was elected President of the Royal Astronomical Society in 1831, serving in that position for two years. Brinkley died in 1835 at Leeson Street, Dublin, and was buried in Trinity College Chapel. He had become a Doctor of Divinity DD and an Honorary Fellow of the Royal Society of Edinburgh HFRSE. He was succeeded at Dunsink Observatory by William Rowan Hamilton. Topic family Brinkley married Esther, daughter of Matthew Weld of Molesworth Street, Sheriff of Dublin City, by his wife Elizabeth Kane, daughter of Nathaniel Kane D. 1757 of Drumreski, Co. Monaghan, Sheriff and Lord Mayor of Dublin co-founder of the Bank of Cain and Latouche. Brinkley and his wife were the parents of two sons and a daughter, John rector of Glanworth, Diocese of Cloyne, who married Anna, second daughter and co-heir of Walter Stevens, of Hybler, Co. Kildare, Sarah Jane second wife of Dr. Robert Graves, who died giving birth to a daughter, and Matthew J.P., of Parsonstown House, Co. Meath, who married Harriet, a daughter of Richard Graves and with her was the father of Francis Brinkley. <laughs> 